Hello and welcome to my video today. This is going to be a test video. I'm going to be looking at the regen and how it slows the car down, especially now since the 2.2 update allows regen on the front and rear motors. I want to test and see if there's a difference if we're in earth mode or fun mode between the regen. I'm going to be testing it on high regen, medium regen, and low regen on both earth and fun modes. So there'll be a total of six different values and I'm gonna run each test twice. So let's get started. Oh, one thing I forgot, I'm gonna be testing from 40 miles an hour down to about 10 miles an hour or about as slow as the car gets without coming to a stop since we don't have one pedal driving. Now I'm going to try to test medium. Now I'm going to be testing low. Now for fun mode. So let's do fun mode in high. Now. Now we'll test medium. Now. And let's now do the final one, fun on low. Now. Let me test one final run through here on hyper. Curious to see if there's any difference between fun and hyper. Now. Now we're gonna try medium. Now. Now.
right, that concludes the testing. When I get back to you in a little bit, I'm going to show you the results. Here's a chart I made from the data of this test. In summary, I tested all three drive modes, Earth, Fun, and Hyper, with the three levels of regen, high, medium, and low. I did two runs for each combination and I averaged the results as you see here in the chart. I was expecting to see a difference between Earth mode and Fun mode since the 2.2 update now allows the rear motor as well as the front motor to regenerate electricity. I was expecting Earth mode to just have regen on the front motor, however as seen by the results that does not seem to be the case. Since all of these seem to have about the same amount of time to slow down, I'm guessing that the regen is using both motors for all the modes. I've never done a test like this before that quantifies the regen modes. Low regen basically takes about twice as long to slow down as medium, and medium takes about twice as long to slow down as high regen. So interesting results. Personally, I leave the regen on high for normal driving. I do change it to low on highway trips. That can result in smoother coasting if needed. And that's about it for the charts. All right, that should about do it for this testing. I hope you found this useful and fun. If you have any questions about this or any other tests you want me to do, please leave me a comment down below. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video.